Hey guys, in this video I am going to show how to add a fallback image if in case uh, the image link is broken. So uh, I am going, I'm going to use, reuse uh, my uh, last uh, project source where I have displayed uh, the image with the circular loading screen. Huh? Actually you can also check the video, uh, the link is in the description. So if I load a page, it will show a spinner before actually uh, we are showing the image so that user will not uh, see uh, the downloading image so if I want to show a fallback uh, image instead of uh, the broken link first I need to uh, set a fallback source to use instead, in, instead of a broken image so I am going to set that in this state So I'm going to use uh, placeholder.com for this demo. So it will uh, provide a specified uh, image or uh, dimensions. It will serve image on the group with uh, specified uh, dimensions or color, everything. It's a customizable. So for this, uh, React provides uh, an on-error uh, call fallback callback uh, for image tags. So I'm going to use this. This will be triggered uh, when uh, there was an error in loading the image. So on this callback, actually what I'm going to do is, uh, I'm going to set a state. Based on that state, uh, we will be determining whether to show the fallback image or uh, the original source. So let me call that uh, error. Let's first uh, define the error in the state as false because initially we will not be know whether it will be a broken image or not. So the page will load. So now based on this error, let me choose which image I need to display. So if it is error, I need to display a fallback image or otherwise I will uh, display the original source URL. So I will replace this image source as the original image source. So if you see uh, the image will load because there was it was not actually a broken image. The URL is serving the image. Now I am going to change modify the image URL and uh, let us check now because obviously it is going to throw error image. Yeah, it's now it, uh, it's displaying our fallback image. If you go to images tab in network, you'll be able to see the first image uh, returns failed status, and uh, immediately the second uh, image is displayed. So the user will not notice this change because of that uh, loading spinner. So it's better to add a loading spinner along with this. Now, if you see, uh, it will show the original image because the URL is actually 200 uh, response so this is actually very simple uh, but this will uh, make uh, your uh, website uh, it will not make your website look ugly when the image is broken live example code is in uh, description guys please check it Thanks for watching the video, please subscribe for more videos like this.